Hi, Dr. Gundry here with a breakfast quiz. Which is healthier, an omelet made only with egg whites or one made with whole eggs? The answer may surprise you. Now, egg whites are a good source of protein, but so are whole eggs, and the yolk of the egg is where the vitamins, minerals, and healthy fats are. And your body needs healthy fats. Your brain practically runs on them. So I recommend using whole eggs, but not just any eggs. I recommend eggs from pasture-raised chickens. And here's why. Pasture-raised chickens eat a natural diet of grass, seed, and bugs. But most eggs come from industrial farm chickens that are fed an artificial diet of corn, soy, and grain, all of which are loaded with spiky, damaging proteins called lectins. And these lectins get passed along in their eggs. Hey, you are what you eat, even chickens. Now, lectins can wreak havoc on your digestive system, leading to fatigue, weight gain, bloating, cramping, cravings for sweets and carbs, occasional constipation, or diarrhea. You see, these spiny lectins can tear holes in the lining of your gut. And when that happens, bad stuff like waste material, yep, I mean poop, can leak into the bloodstream and attack every part of the body. Joints, skin, heart, brain, everything. Should breakfast be sweet or savory? I get this question a lot. Is it best to start my day with something sweet or something savory? Well, a nice egg is healthier than a bowl of sugary cereal, but in-season berries are likely healthier than a fatty slice of bacon. So here's my surprising answer. Neither. The best flavor for starting your day is actually sour. Just look at what they're eating in some of the healthiest countries in the world. A traditional Korean breakfast is heavy on kimchi, a spicy fermented cabbage dish. While in Japan, many people love to start their day with pickled radish and natto, or fermented soybeans. Both of these sour fermented foods are great sources of probiotics, the good gut bugs that help you with everything from digestion to energy levels to mental clarity. Now, here in America, the only sour food on most breakfast menus is yogurt. But frankly, most yogurt is loaded with sugar, as well as the potentially harmful casein A1. So, you could be canceling out the benefits of the probiotics inside. And even if you're eating the right yogurt, made from coconut or A2 milk without all those added sugars, we now know that probiotics are only one-third of the battle. To set yourself up for optimal gut health, you'll also want prebiotics, which are finally getting a little more attention from food companies.